on, buddy. Ooh, that thing was fun. Follow me. Let's go. Um, hey, hey, we need to go this way. Okay, so this morning is a little different. So instead of just doing my chores, we have my mother's chores and my chores. So it's gonna be a longer morning for me. For you, it's gonna be edited down to like seven, eight minutes, but for me, it's about an hour and a half of feeding. So I thought I'd just take you guys along this morning so you can see what it's like around the whole farm. So I hope you guys enjoy. say um, I did some of my mother's chores yesterday to just try and get the feel and some of them were harder than they are today. Hey Pig, you know where to go, right? Yeah, down this area. My mangoes won't fed. Um, this is not your bowl. This is, hold on. Buddy, I forgot to pet you, I'm sorry. I forgot we did grain last night and um, now I have so many full buckets that I don't even have to fill any for my animals this morning. They're more shocked, if anything, because Preston has never fed us before. Hi. Wait, why do I hear chicken? Wait, get out. Okay. This chicken made a nest in the trash bag of hay for the goats. Oh, they're down there. They're turning down there. Goats, their water has to be dumped out and refilled twice a day. Keep parasites. To help with parasites, because they're very prone to parasites. You ever wonder what's screaming their heads off in the morning when I do the farm tours? These are the things. Yes, they look little, but they got some lungs on them. Hello, chickies. Enjoy, chickies. Funny story for you. For some odd reason, I forgot to close the chicken coop last night. So it never occurred to me, hey, I should probably chest. I should probably shut the chickens in so they don't get eaten. No, never occurred. It's a short stuff egg. Look how big that is in my hand. 
she was in a nesting box last night and I was gonna close the nesting boxes, but she was in one. And then from there on out, I forgot to close them and the chicken coop that night. So, uh, yes. <laughs> They're all fine. One big task I got done in the field was I got the rest mowed. I just need to grab a reel and pick the fencing up today. The reason we mow it is um, people who use the intensive grazing system, is, which is what we use, they run sheep behind their cattle to get rid of all the, of the stuff they don't eat, the cows don't eat. And we don't have sheep yet, yet. So um, we just mow behind them, not like really far down, just a little bit to get rid of the weeds so that the grass comes better, back better. This was all weed and it's now green grass. That's pretty much it for my morning, for my chores, because the chickens or the crosses already have food and water. That pig has to be outside for just like 15, 20 minutes, and then and I think, yeah, then I take her back in. But that's all of my mom's chores and my chores for the morning. You know, we didn't have to move cows, no chickens, no, yes, we didn't have to move cows or chickens, which was good. But um, in the next vlog, I think we're gonna be moving, I, I know it's chickens, and I can't remember if it's, because I have like a schedule for how many times they should be moved in a week. So from what I can tell, it looks like the cows are gonna be moved tomorrow and the chickens. That means layer hands and corner crosses. Lots of moving tomorrow. What's well, tomorrow for me and couple days for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!